So the Halloween update from Anime Last Day and finally came out and it's actually something unique compared to other updates. In this video I'll be getting some of the new units and evolving them. The start of this video is from my stream so the audio is a little bad. It's only for the first like 40 seconds though. Hope you guys will enjoy the video anyway. Alright, new map. Uh, I think it's like Helsing or something. Wait, what? Oh, wait. Oh, there's a thing in the corner here. Whatever that is. Okay, thank god. What is all this? I don't, I don't know what it picked. Uh, we got pumpkin essence and candy. See, and here I just click roll and it just picks something. I don't know how I'm supposed to pick myself. I just click roll. Someone got, uh, someone got Sid from wave 50. What is this update even about? I'm not really sure. I don't know where I get the new units. That's like the main part of the update. I don't know where I get them. Oh, I got some, uh, shards and a tier one. Wow. 10 minutes for this. Merchant? What? I don't think he works. Oh my God. It's eloquent, but you can barely see see him the w game okay that was fast okay we got johan uh and nothing else okay right, we might have to keep the next mythic trait not gonna lie with this look i'm just keeping the next mythic trait oh what is that what is that animation that is so bad pride skin it's not terrible i like the scythe it looks like they put more effort into this than the actual pride but i still just prefer anime characters oh i got that i got said dubs so he has an evil now right surely the game will give me something though right we're starting with 400 rerolls overlord oh avatar let's go dubs another avatar the avatar curse is real Alright, so I ended the stream and got something to eat. Now it's basically just about getting the Sid and the Johan Evo here. Uh, they're like 2.5k each of this candy. They're like two of the cheapest Evos, which is really nice. I'm not gonna lie, the Sid Evo looks more interesting to me, so I'm gonna get him first. Uh, but yeah, I mean, uh, right now I'll just go ahead and grind some portals and uh, show my completion, I guess. Not much else to do. It's just a portal grind. I will need to farm some uh, other stuff for the Shadow Evo though like some dark essence and cosmic essence okay so i'm pretty sure after this run i can evo one of these units and i'm gonna go for sid first because in my opinion he is the coolest and well um i quickly want to go over them like unevo how good they are i'm not gonna show effects and everything i'll do that at the end maybe i'm not really sure but yeah i mean sid not gonna lie it's not that bad of damage on placement they definitely buffed him 100 percent. he was doing like 26k at oh actually did they i think they did yeah i think think so yeah it's still not great it's still not great to be honest but you definitely want to evo him and johan is uh he's he's pretty mid he's not fully aoe or anything he's just a circle aoe like this i think yeah just a circle he's just okay he's not crazy but hopefully his evo is a lot better oh let's go i finally got a tier 5 after this portal so that means i can maybe start getting a secret portal soon maybe uh and i got some candy yeah um i'll go back to lobby and uh, buy some stuff okay so yeah as i said we got enough for the city one now we just need this one right yeah okay uh unequip and that means i got the evil item but i do need the cosmic essence and the dark essence to get this so i need to do some caverns um uh, which i hate but it has to be done for the evo and luckily i don't think any of the other units need this essence they just need pumpkin essence which i have a lot of that i don't really need well I gotta go grind that cosmic and dark essence, I guess. Okay, so we can finally get the first diva. That did take a while, I'm not gonna lie. We can craft the cosmic essence here that we needed. And now we can get the evolution, I think. Yep, yep, we can. Nice. Shadow Enraged Avatar. Uh, interesting that he evolves from his, uh, you know, shadow form to his school form. But, hey, it's cool. And Blessing is... Blessing is not bad. Blessing is not bad. It's not... It's nothing crazy, which I like. I like simple blessings. Um, uh, let's unequip these guys and let's equip the shadow here because I'm gonna have to level him up. On placement, he's doing 388k level 1. No, no, let's go for Johan Evo. Yeah, let's do that. I only need 2.5k and I do have a tier 5 portal now that I will hopefully not lose. Where is it? There. Immunity. It, that's, that's definitely possible. I can definitely do that. 
Oh, we got a secret portal. Nice. Okay, no more fix art, but we did get a secret portal. What is it? Bear bones. Really, bro? Bear bones? Oh, I did get re -wiped, but it's probably a little too hard. Okay, I mean, I think we got it under control. We, I got really lucky, and it chose the 100k upgrade. I think it's still random whatever upgrade it chooses, but we got that one at first, so I think we're gonna chill now. Well, um, apparently secret portals don't drop Alucard. He's just the secret from capsules so i mean basically got nothing uh, i don't really know what the point of the secret portals are i don't know why they're even in the game i guess a little more candy if it gives more i'm not sure uh i thought i got enough for johan evo or johan how are you pronounce it i don't know yeah i thought the secret portal would give more i'm not gonna lie well i mean i guess i gotta do one more and then i got enough for the johan evo i really don't understand why i get so much pumpkin essence i only need 25 for the evo i think it was 25 right yeah i only need 25 i really really don't get that but yeah uh i'll uh, i'll do one more portal i'll get johan and after that i'll i'll see what i do okay that is this stage done so we can finally buy that evo item did take a while but we finally got it i i hate grinding for evo items it's so boring compared to like just gambling but yeah let's um uh, let's go ahead and and let's, I was about to say roll, but we already have Avatar, so we just gotta evo him. Monster Destructive. Uh, this is a really interesting unit because he's not, he doesn't have like any superpowers. He's just a normal human. So I think it's kind of interesting. I'm not too hyped for him. I'm not gonna lie, but it's okay, buddy. Okay. Another one, really? Well, that doesn't matter. Uh, I'll go ahead and level these guys up because I want to see their... I, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just mostly interested in this guy's attack effects. Like, he's gonna be shooting guns and bazookas and stuff. And I saw something about Lightning McQueen. I'm not sure which unit does that. If that's, like, Johan or if that's Ryuk. Uh, I'm also interested in uh, Sid's new moves. I'm guessing he has new moves, right? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, spam some story to level up. I think that's still the best way to do it. Okay, we are finally done leveling these guys up. It takes a while to level these ultimate units up. I hate it. I am not doing skill tree on these guys. I can tell y'all that right now. I don't think I'm gonna be using these units much. Also, he has a cosmetic. What is it? It's a uh, gun with a bazooka. I mean, eh, it's okay. I think I prefer the sword. Goes better with the avatar. Now, let's go ahead and check these guys out here are the stats and none of them have like souls on them or anything so let's uh let's check out how good these guys are okay so it's finally time to check the best thing about als the effects um let's uh turn it into 1x speed because if we don't it look really really goofy so to start off with he uh he does some sword slashes that uh look really interesting yeah uh do i have low no i have high graphics okay um yeah that does not look good. Let's uh, keep upgrading. Actually, before that, let's quickly take a look at his placement damage. I know he's 3k to place, so it's not that cheap, but like his damage, that is pretty good for 3k, you no? Know? Well, let's keep upgrading, and he gets nuclear grenades. Yeah, he, uh, he throws purple orbs at them, or grenades, I think that's, yeah, grenades. Not the most uh crazy VFX, but not everything has to be crazy, and then he uh, does the uh, top. Oh, that is nice, that is nice, I'm not gonna lie. As much as I usually hate on these VFX, that is actually nice. It's nothing, it's not like insane insane. But it looks nice. I like this. I like this. Is that his last? Oh, it is his last. Um, and his last upgrade was 1 million. Before that, he was only 100k though. So you're usually not going to get the 1 million upgrade. Uh, let's check his nuke. Let's see what that looks like. Celestial Strike. I want to wait for his uh, attack here to finish. And then let's try. See, uh, nothing happened. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Nothing happened. Crazy. It's, uh, it takes forever to load back but what it does is global new 10 billion damage damage stunned the enemies turns into base hp doesn't overheal base what does overheal mean does that mean i have to take damage to the base and then he heals the base after because that would be really really useless i hope it's not that and it's multi-hit from what i'm seeing right let's uh let's check the hp yep it is it is okay well that's enough of him let's get to uh, johan this guy i'm really interested in so 
So he starts off by shooting his uh, Glock here, right? Okay, I was kind of expecting like some bullets or something, but I guess we just get a little bit of effect on the gun. He does have a passive. Every enemy killed has 50% chance of being manipulated and turning into an ally. Ooh, that is... That could be good, but he has to kill them. Okay, let's see if uh, let's see if uh, we can get this thing to happen. I'm not seeing anything now. I mean, I'm guessing it just turns around and goes towards them, right? Surely it doesn't like spawn at the base or something. Does he have to get to a sudden upgrade or something? I don't, I don't really see anything happening with them turning around or anything. No spawns. Yeah, I don't really know if this works, but let's keep upgrading. Let's see his next attack. Is the bazooka right? Yeah, he uh, he basically just fires a bazooka, right? Does he? take it off his back can an enemy come in here oh wait no he just fires fire out of his hand or okay he throws a fireball i thought it was the bazooka bullet rain Ooh, this sounds cool okay well it's just a bunch of shots that's uh that's cool that's cool at max he's doing 30 million every three seconds without skill tree of course and he does slow which is something i guess this passive i don't really get it um i'm kind of confused uh, i don't see them turning around or anything but uh that is basically it i mean i'm only getting these two units for this video i think i'm just gonna grind for alucard now and i've been up for it like nearly 24 hours now i think so i gotta get to editing and then i gotta wait to post it and stuff hope you guys enjoyed this video though and thank you guys for watching